One of my favorite Queen songs of all time is Another One Bites the Dust. And that is exactly what The Bachelor was about this week. We started with 11 lady testants and we are down to the final four, which makes it the best episode we've had all year because we eliminated almost two thirds of the misery. So we are almost to the end. We only got four left. Two of the ones that made it were not a surprise. Two of them who got it, quite much a surprise for all four of us on Three Dudes Watch The Bachelor. Um, so we're finally plummeting toward the end of this fiasco. Uh, our fear is that the show may never come back after this. I don't know that it can be rescued. Matt's a great guy, a great human being, but a boring, boring bachelor. And these lady testants that they picked this year are just mean human beings. They're just not even good people. So it's guaranteed not to even work out in the end. We all know that Matt, when this thing's over, is going to dump whoever he selects. He's moving to Hollywood. He's going to find him some celebrity and he'll be in Us Magazine for the next six months with all the celebrities he's dating. We know it's going to happen. You know it's going to happen, too. But anyway, check out our episode this week on uh, The Bachelor. It's almost over. We're down to the final four. We've got hometowns coming up this week. Uh, then we get, I guess, the fantasy suites. It's going to be interesting to see how that works when they're all in the same hotel. Uh, and then we'll be hopefully down to the final rows. So it's the end's near. So stick with us for just a couple more episodes, and we'll get through this together because it takes togetherness to get through this misery.